Spring is here and we all know what that means. It's time to take one of those great trips we've been putting off. And why is that? Because the prices are going down, the crowds are thinning, and the weather is delightful. Isn't that right? Janine Tor Tornatori, did I say your yes, name correct, yes. from Orbitz, is here to tell us more. Great to have you. Thanks for being here. My pleasure. So you, you have some top picks. Let's start with East Coast beach towns. Sure. Well, if you wait till Memorial Day weekend, from Myrtle Beach to Martha's Vineyard, things are going to be sold out. The prices spike. This is when the big summer travel season hits in these destinations. So May is really the time to go. You know, I love Charleston in May because if you have a couple of cool days, you can still, you know, do things in this wonderful historic town. My hotel pick here is the Francis Marion Hotel. On orbit, it's $189 a night in May. This is about 23% cheaper than what you might usually see. Fantastic and gorgeous hotel. Absolutely I beautiful. To to Charleston, so maybe that's time to plan that trip. Right. Now, what if we want something a little bit more exotic? Sure. Well, Mexico and the Caribbean, May is really the sweet spot for this destination. It's after all the spring breakers have gone home. We're right on the tail end of that right now, but before hurricane season hits in June. So, you know, there are no crowds. The weather is wonderful. And you have all these all-inclusives that really are looking to fill their rooms. So we've got the Occidental Grand in Riviera Maya, an all-inclusive property, four stars from $180 a night in May. That includes all of your meals. Oh, a wonderful value. Deal. Yes. Wow, I love that. Can, can we go now? Yes, I'm all ready to go. go. <laughs> but now what about Europe? It's always expensive, right? We're never going to find a deal. Yeah, I mean, airfares have been up to Europe the last couple of mm -hmm. years, certainly. I really like spring and fall for Europe because once you get into summer, you know, this is the high season mm -hmm. of the year for all sure. of these European cities. So spring is really the time to go to find some value. London, Rome, Amsterdam, these all have, you know, low lower prices right now on airfares, but really you're going to save on hotels. But I really love Ireland right now. That's where we're seeing some of the biggest value. So to give you an example, a, a package to Dublin, airfare from New York City plus five nights staying at the Four Star North Star Hotel in Dublin, a beautiful property in the heart of the city, Gorgeous. just over $1,300. And come summer, you're going to be paying that for your airfare alone. So if wow. you're looking for that European escape, now's the time to go. Absolutely. I haven't been to Europe in years because I thought it was out of yes. my price range, but maybe I need to think about <laughs> Ireland. Thank you so much. Now, what about one of those Alaskan cruises? Would we just be crazy to go in May? Is it still freezing that time you of know, year? It, it's a little bit of a gamble on the weather, and mm -hmm. that's why the prices are so great. It's really popular during the summer. So if you want to go and save a lot of money, you'll have a little gamble on the weather. The highs may be in the 50s or 60s right now, but you have the beautiful snow-capped mountains. It's arguably one of the most beautiful times to go there. Uh, to give you an idea of the prices though, are, are, they're amazing. A seven-night Alaska and Sawyer Glacier cruise on Norwegian cruise lines out of Seattle, $619 per person. That's amazing. just over $80 a night. So wow. fantastic prices if you're willing to take that slight gamble. That is one of those things on my bucket list, so yes. I might have to <laughs> check it out. Denise Territory, thank you so much.